Hi guys, greetings of the day. Myself Raghavendra. Today we are going with a plate problem. A rectangular plate of negligible thickness of size 35 by 20 mm has one of its shorter edges in BB, with that edge inclined at 40 degree to HP. Draw the top view if its front view is a square of side 20 mm. So it is a rectangular plate of 35 mm by 20 mm side. It is resting on BP with one of its shorter edges. So out of these two values, shorter edge is 20 mm. So 20 mm should be towards left side. And as it is resting on BP, it has to be parallel to BP. The front view is the square of 20 mm side. He has not given the file. Whereas on which edge it is resting, the same edge has to make an angle of 40 degree with respect to HP. That is theta is equal to 40 degree. As it is the edge, it is a non-locus problem. First, draw a thin line. Name it as X, Y, V, P, H, P. V, P, H, P. As it is resting on V, P, so we have to draw here and 20 mm towards left side. So 20 35. One second, 20. 35. This is 20 mm, whereas this one is 35 mm. Naming A dash B dash C dash D dash. I plotted the points in donor direction with thin line. From this end point till x y line, from this end point till x y line. Join these two end points with thick line. So naming A is visible, B is invisible. Similarly, D is visible, C is invisible. So it will be A in the bracket B, and this one is D in the bracket C. So the arrow mark in donor direction. So this completes the first position. For the second position, he has not given the phi. Instead, he has given the front view looks like a square of 20 mm. So project this one in horizontal direction with thin line. Now construct a square of 20 mm. So this is a square of 20 mm. As it is a square, we have to show the square symbol. So square 20. Naming will be same. A dash. B dash. C dash. D dash. The project in downward direction with a thin line from this point till x y line, and from this point, project in downward direction. This is A in the bracket B. Somewhere on this line, we'll get D in the bracket C. To get that one, from A in the bracket B as a center, we have to cut an arc of length this much. So, this length is equal to this much because both are parallel to each other, that is 35 mm. So take arc by center point. A in the bracket B as center, 35 mm is the radius. Cut an arc. Join these two points with thick line. This is D in the bracket C. Arrow mark will be towards the right side and downward.
No, this angle will give us the phi with respect to PP. 55 degree. For the third position, he has given the resting edge. Resting edge is A dash B dash. It has to make an angle of 40 degree with respect to HP. So first draw a 40 degree line. So the angle of this line should be 40 degree. 40 degree. So A dash B dash should be on this line. The dimension will be 20 mm. So directly we can draw 20 mm. No, this is A dash, B dash. We have to get A dash, B dash and B dash, C dash. So both are perpendicular to A dash, B dash. So from A dash as, from A dash, draw a 20 mm line. If we get that perpendicular symbol, so that is nothing but both are perpendicular to each other. So 20 mm. Similarly from this end point. 20 mm. Complete. So this will be C dash. Whereas this one is D dash. Project in downward direction with thin line. E dash. It is in the top in on x y line till x y line b dash till x y line now before drawing from d dash and d, c, c dash and d dash first from c in the bracket d d in the bracket c draw horizontal line so from c dash till this line similarly from d dash till this line here is the extra lines This is D, C, B, A. Join all the four parts with thick line. A, B, C, D, A. Show the arrow marks. Right side. Down. So this angle we have to show that is phi is equal to 55 degree. Phi is equals to 55 degree. This completes the problem. Thank you. Please subscribe my channel.